a Bedouin once asked the Prophet when he was describing Jannah and he said, Ya Rasulullah, can we farm? Sorry, not a Bedouin, a man asked, Ya Rasulullah, can we farm in Jannah? I want to plant and graze. And the Prophet he said, he, he smiled. He said, Rajulan, and a Rajulan min ahlil Jannah istadhan rabbahu fi zar. A man in paradise sought permission from his Lord if he can plant. Allah said to him, Are you not already in whatever you desire, whatever you wish for can just happen? He will say, Yes, my Lord, I am in anything I desire. He said, I like to plant. Allah Rasulullah says, and so he is granted that. He plants the seed and it immediately begins to blossom and his eyesight and the growth of his plantation begin to race each other very quickly. And it's ripened and it is ready so quickly and it is so far from that one seed that he could see his plantation as, as much as mountains. And then Allah says, Dunaka yabna Adam, fa'innaka la yushbi'uka shay'. So the man goes after all his plantation, he sees it the size of mountains and he wants to grab it all. And Allah says, O oh son of Adam, nothing is enough for you. And Allah is happy about that. And he tells us, his pleasure, his pleasure is saying that I don't want you to ever be run out of satisfaction. You'll always be satisfied and always get more. And because I have created you in a way where you will never get enough. And so Jannah is made for those who will never get enough. You'll always want more. You'll always want more. And then one man, a better one, said, Ya Rasulullah, Wallahi, this man who's asked to plant in Jannah, I don't see him except one of the Muhajireen or the Ansar. He's not one of us. We better ones don't like to plant. I don't want to be that. And the Prophet laughed. Fadahika sallallahu alayhi wa sallam.